This is my very first print after fully upgrading my K1 Max with the K1 Series CFS Upgrade Accessory Kit. I didn't want to print the stock boat off the USB stick. I wanted to print something with multiple colours that would uh, test out the colour changing and quick colour changing. The whole process of fitting the upgrade kit took me a couple of hours. Uh, I took it nice and slow. I went by the official video step by step and uh, everything went very smoothly until I got to the final step which was the USB stick which uh, didn't appear to be running the upgrade. Um, what I did is I copied the USB stick onto my PC and then copied it onto another USB stick and uh, that worked fine. After that it's been running great, uh, switching the colours, it all seems to be very smooth, I haven't had any issues at all so far. This is Creality Print 6, I'm still messing, I haven't done colour printing before, I'm still messing with setting it up and uh, how to get it to print and colouring in the prints but it seems to be working fine, I've since done uh, multiple different prints, I'm mainly doing coasters at the moment because I find it's uh, Nice quick test. If anyone has any questions on the fitting and process, uh, please feel free to use the comments to ask and I'll genuinely do my best to answer every single one. The purge system and cutting system works well. It doesn't seem to create a lot, well, I, the size of the K1 Max, uh, unless you were doing something really, really big, you wouldn't have to clear out any, uh, any purge until the print had finished. This is the printing in process, that's showing the CFS, you can edit that and change the colours. I printed two on here. If you're printing the same design, it's better to print multiples, then it's not constantly switching colour. This has been fitted four days now, and I've been uh, printing virtually constantly since and done several different designs. And uh, as I say, I, I haven't really had any issues at all. I haven't had any blockages, uh, the switching's gone nice and smoothly. And yeah, I'm really pleased with it, and I'm looking forward to doing a lot more designs. I think at some point I will look at uh, creating a riser and putting the CFS on top of the machine uh, just for space saving really. I do like the filament change system with the CFS, it saves messing about changing the filament, just feeding the reels in and it just feeds it straight through to the uh, head. And that's the coaster finished. I shall upload this to Creality Cloud and release it free if anyone wants to print them. And I've, I've put a little stand with it as well, so I'll put pictures of that at the end. I'll just finish off with a time lapse of the printing. And if you like the video, please like and subscribe, it's always most appreciated. And thank you for watching.